Good morning. It is so dark outside right now. I have no idea why. I feel like it was, I don't know, Zach and I were talking last night. He was on his way home. He was like, is it still light out right now? And I'm like, yeah, it is. And we thought it was a little weird. And now I am... I mean, I, I left a few minutes earlier than usual because I stopped for gas, but um, not that many minutes because everything I need is on my exact route to work, so I just have to like pull off a little. But it is so dark right now. I'm going to Starbucks, and I like packed up my whole knitting bag this morning, ready for Christina in the car knitting haul. <laughs> so I'm gonna open up my mini. And it's like pitch black. So, I don't know if we're going to do that, but I don't know if you're going to get another Christina in the car until next Vlogmas. So, I thought I would just give you a little bit longer, even though I don't really have a ton to talk about. It's, um, oh shoot. Okay, the light stayed yellow. It's put through a red light. It's 7.30. And it's so dark. I don't know what's going on. Today's my office holiday party, so we're just going to have like a fun, this is so flattering, look at this, <laughs> this really is Christmas, um, Christmas themed vlog today, uh, I got my ugly sweater on and I'm lit up by taillights at a stop sign, stop light. This is not cute. Sorry for the lighting. I mean, I could like do, no, that wouldn't even help me. Um, that's a little better. It's so dark, what the heck? Um, I can't remember even what I was talking about. Oh, it's our office holiday party day. So I'm going to my usual Starbucks run. I guess I'm just gonna have to show you my mini later having like a little secret Santa. We're going to play some kind of holiday trivia game, which should be interesting because some of our team members are permanently remote and don't live in our area. So the good news is the Starbucks drive through is long. So maybe that will mean it'll get a little bit lighter sooner and then probably not. In the event that I'm still sitting here and it's late outside, I'll do my haul. But we have a holiday party. We're going to do something cute. Then we're going to go to lunch. And then I'm probably going to go home. And I'm really in the Christmas spirit. I'm super excited. And I'm very close to finishing my socks. So I'm really looking forward to doing that. I get nervous. This girl's about to walk past my car. I hope she doesn't see that I'm like, I don't think she saw. <laughs> Talking to myself, but here comes another person to judge me. <laughs> Hello. I'm home for the day and haven't had a chance to look today. I haven't had a chance to open my advent because it's been a really crazy, fun, full day. Oh, actually, I need to open my bag. Let me grab my work stuff. Today... Today was my company holiday party, and it was really fun, and it was a really great day, but I didn't have any time to open my mini for the day, and I also got something that made me scream from one of my colleagues that I want to show you because it is so cute. Let's start with the mini. Today's day 22. Goodness gracious. I, I don't know why I said that like that. I can't believe... This is almost over. Today's colorway is called Ice Castle. And I'm guessing that this is Sparkle and some like 
bold shade of blue and maybe like some white. Oh, okay. Well, I definitely was right on the sparkle. This is incredible. So it's a lot darker in the one area and mine is a little bit lighter. This is beautiful. This is so pretty. It's more of, um, I don't know. It's hard to tell. It's blue-ish, but it's very, like it's almost a little purpley blue. Like I feel like it's showing up very purple. Maybe it is purple. It looks more like periwinkle down here. So pretty. But the thing that I wanted to show you was someone in my office got all of us little Christmas ornaments. I can open this. And mine is still in its bag, so let me take it out. How do I open it? You aren't ready. Mine is a knitting mouse. <laughs> Look how cute. It's little glasses. It's knitting a little scarf. <laughs> I actually screamed. I was like, oh, how cute. And then I go, it's knitting. <laughs> when our new hire was sitting next to me and they were like, I'm sorry, it's what? <laughs> Because my other colleagues know that I love to knit. So I was so, it's so cute. I was so excited about it. I can't wait to put it on our mostly undecorated tree. But I was really excited to show you that. It is 4.30 right now. I've got dinner in the crock pot. So there won't be much dinner to do tonight. Um, I'll be help helping Zach tonight finish up the last big batch of his seasoning and jarring it, canning it, what have you. And we need to do some serious Christmas wrapping. And I also need to run out and do some last minute shopping. So... Hopefully I'll be able to get all of those things done tonight. And I also would love to really cruise through the foot on this. So I want to dedicate some time to really get knitting on this. I think tomorrow is not going to be the day that I expected it to be because I need to have a repair done to my office laptop and uh, long story short was I was told earlier this week by the computer company um, that due to parts shortages and the holidays that there will be a delay in sending someone out to my home to fix it, but no matter what, I was in the service queue and someone would be calling me to schedule a time to come out to fix my computer. So I got a text message this morning once I arrived at the office saying that my service technician was confirmed to be at my house between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. today. And they needed me to confirm that I would be home to let them in. And I would not be home. So I had to schedule my service to happen tomorrow. And the window they gave me is 9 a.m. to 6 p.m., which is somewhat annoying. But it's even more annoying because I also scheduled a car service at 8 a.m. tomorrow. I'm supposed to be dropping off my car to finish the registration process for my car by the end of the year. 
and I'm going to be carless and now someone is coming to my house because that was my only other option until I can't remember the other days but it was pretty much my only other option and I didn't really want to deal with somebody being here when I'm supposed to be off so I don't know how tomorrow is going to be I'm hoping that these people come later in the day when I could be sitting at home or I don't know or that my car service is really quick the guy's squeezing me in and I'm super excited about that but I don't know that my day is going to be as relaxing as I had hoped but at least I'll get these things off of my plate and I really wanted to cruise through the foot tonight but maybe I will I don't know I guess work on the heel of Zach sock tonight so that I have plenty of vanilla knitting tomorrow not that a toe is too difficult but if I'm gonna be like in and out of you know an auto body shop and potentially dealing with some people here then I don't know I want something that I don't have to worry about oh did I decrease there <laughs> Am I going to decrease round? So we'll see how that goes. <laughs>